Thank you, Papa Smurf. We've never been to a Smurf picnic before, right, Pee-wee? Mmm, -hmm. delicious. I'm hungrier than the goblin of Boulder Woods. Goblin? <laughs> oh, yes. A goblin once lived in the forest near the king's castle. Oh, that's spooky. This goblin once had the whole kingdom shaking in its boots. Tell him the story, Johan. Oh, good. A story. Now, everybody gather round. Smurf in closer, my little Smurfs. Uh, Red! Ugh. Not that close, Clumsy. Is it an adventure story, Johan? Oh, there's plenty of adventure, Hefty. <laughs> what about jokes? I just love jokes. <laughs> yes, Jokey, there are some jokes. And is there a princess in it, Johan? Yes, Smurfette, a princess too. Ooh, tell us, Johan! Yeah, tell us a story! Well, it all started before I knew Pee-wee. A mysterious goblin was frightening everyone in Boulder Woods. Oh, Papa Smurf, I'm getting scared already. Be careful, Smurfette. I think the goblin is closer than you think. <coughs> the adventure began as I rode out from the king's castle, never dreaming that I would meet up with a dangerous goblin that very day. Hmm, that sounds like Francois the Woodcutter. I must hurry and finish before the fearsome goblin returns. <sighs> well, time for my apple. Ah, someone ate my apple! A goblin! That's funny. I could have sworn I heard Francois. Psst. Johan, is that you? Francois! Did you see him? See who? A terrible goblin that's haunting Boulder Woods. Goblin? I thought everybody knew. He's only this big, and he makes horrible faces. And he just ate my apple. He's in there. No one here? Are you sure? Ah! Over there. Goblin or not, I'm getting to the bottom of this. Aha! Francois, I've got him. You see? This goblin is more clever than I thought. He must be long gone by now, but I'll capture him yet. Goodbye, Francois. Princess Sabina returns today, and her room must be redecorated, the floor scrubbed, a tournament held in her other, and then we must see to it that the servants... Enough! Royal Game Hen, my favorite. Ah. What? Guards! Guards! Help! My hen! Sire? My hen is gone! Sire, a mysterious goblin is plaguing the kingdom. That's nothing! He's stolen my game hen! I want this creature caught! This goblin thinks only of his stomach. That gives me an idea. Now I've got you! Hey! Let me go! You're hurting me! You're hurting me! Ah! Fooled ya! <laughs> hey! Come back here! Pee-wee! Pee-wee! Stop, you urchin! <laughs> come back here, you varlet! Now, where could he have gone? Aha! Thought 
you had me stumped, eh? The cat! The cat! The cat! The cat! <laughs> now I've got you all! <laughs> nice work, the cat! After him, the cat! What's your name, Goblin? Pee-wee. And this is Biquette. Nee. Who are you? I am Johan, the King's Squire. You know, for a Goblin, you don't look very fierce. And for a big guy, you don't look very mean. Hey, do you have any more food? Just this loaf of... That'll do! ...bread. Tell me, you haven't always lived in this forest. What did you do before? Mm. I went from farm to farm, looking for work. Well, people would make fun of me and... Mm, takes me away. Mm. Mm. Uh, I've tracked a lot of trails with an empty stomach. You're not a goblin at all. <laughs> of course not. One day in the forest, a man saw me and fled, screaming, there's a goblin in Boulder Woods. <laughs> so now I pretend to be one, and I get away with plenty. Like stealing swords. Can't you do anything besides steal? Well, um, let me think. I can do somersaults and cartwheels. I have a full repertoire of interesting expressions. <laughs> and best of all, I can sing. Me, 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 me. A bold young knight went off to fight for the hand of his lady fair. Oh! Forsooth said she, I'll marry thee, and you won't have a care. Oh, you won't have a care. Oh, oh, you won't have a care. Oh, that's uh, excellent, Pee-wee. You know, I think I can get you a job in the castle. As the king's minstrel singer? No, as the king's joker. Huh? Hey, that's even better. I know lots of jokes. Did you hear the one about the... Sorry, Pee-wee, but I've got to get back to the castle. I'll speak to the king, and if he agrees, you can tell it to him. Oh, boy! A boy! young knight went off to fight for the hand of his lady fair. Oh! All is in readiness for Princess Sabina's arrival, sire. Excellent. Now, what about this goblin fellow? What's his name? Pee-wee, sire. And he's completely reformed. I would even propose that you employ him as... Your Highness! Oh, your Highness! Princess Sabina's been kidnapped! Kidnapped? Call the guards! Call the guards! Yes, Your Majesty. The goblin attacked us as we were crossing Boulder Woods. Oh, my poor, poor Sabina. She's just a child. Kiwi? Well, he couldn't have. First he tied up the guards, then he carried the princess away. Angelot and I were the only ones to escape. As we ran, we heard his terrible scream. Kiwi! Kiwi! Oh, no. He did. Pee-wee, is it? Well, he'll be screaming something far worse if I ever catch him. One thousand crowns to whomever saves the princess and brings that villainous Pee-wee to me. After him! Pee-wee must not escape! But why would Pee-wee kidnap the princess? I don't understand it. I'm going to find out. Hi, Johan. What's... All right, Pee-wee. Why have you kidnapped Princess Sabina? Me? I didn't kidnap her, Johan, but I saw the rascals who did. They were dressed up as the king's guard, two of them, and they rode back towards the castle. The scoundrels. They were the ones who accused you of the crime to throw us off the scent. But what can we do? I'm sorry I doubted you, Pee-wee. <gasps> Come on, I have a plan. Halt! Who goes here? Oh, Squire Yoan, it's you. I'm sorry to see you didn't find the princess. No luck with the goblin either. Oh, it's hot in here. Be quiet. Your dinner, my friends. Compliments of the king. Oh, thank you, sire. I'm so hungry I could eat a goblin. <laughs> and not a pint-sized one like that peewee either. <laughs> eat hearty, men. Ah, good riddance. We fooled them all. <laughs> our master, Wolfricket, will reward us well for our part in the kidnapping of the Princess Sabina. Mm. And the best part of all mm, was blaming everything on that little fool, Pee-wee. <laughs> that little fool, Pee-wee. little fool, Pee-wee. Play! You kicked me! 
I did not. Ow! You kicked me! Why you? Kick me, will you? Take that! It shouldn't be long now. Ah! Huh. I may be little, but I'm no fool. So, Walter Cat is the villain who kidnapped Princess Sabina. Right! Let's go tell the king and clear my name. Then his army will take care of Walter Cat. Pow! Wham! It's not that simple, Pee-wee. We must go to Walter Cat's castle and get proof. <laughs> Pee-wee, we're here. Pee-wee, wake up. This goblin is a deep sleeper. What? Oh, help! Sound the alarm! <gasps> That's Sir Liferoy, one of His Majesty's knights. He must be in on the kidnapping as well. <sighs> Oh. I must go after him. Pee-wee, you hide. Oh, anything you say, you hide. <sighs> Good evening, Sir Pyfroy. Is it not a strange place and an odd time for a ride? Uh, I'm looking for that uh, uh, goblin, Pee-wee. In Waltriquette's castle? What were you really doing there? It's none of your business, Barlet. Now, let me try! After him, they are! Yeah, yeah! Ha ha! He'll never catch me on that fool horse! Steady, Bayard! <laughs> All right, Pyfroy, where is Princess Sabina? In my castle, Johan! Where else? <laughs> and don't worry, I'll see that you have adjoining dungeons. <laughs> Sir Pyfoy is in on it, too. I must tell the king. But, but the king still thinks I kidnapped the princess. Oh, Johan, what am I going to do? Who says they don't build dungeons like they used to? There goes that villainous Pyfroy, and there's nothing I can do to prevent his treachery. At last, it looks like everything's going according to plan. Pee-wee! Help! Let me loose! Let me loose! Ha <laughs> ha Hmm, that hay wagon gives me an idea. I hope I can overpower the guard. Uh, my master wishes to see you. Come with me. Oh, charming. I get a giant instead of a guard. Ah, Johan! I'm so happy you could join me. As for me, I don't like the company of traitors. Why have you kidnapped the princess? Ha! At this very moment, Sir Pyfroy goes to tell the king that Pee-wee the Goblin demands a ransom for her, and he must deliver it himself. Now I understand. You'll ambush his majesty as you did the princess. And in exchange for their freedom, half his kingdom will be mine. You're a clever fellow, Johan. Why don't you join my side? Never. In that case, guard, take him away. Pee-wee! Pee-wee! Pee-wee? I'll get to the bottom of... Boom! Sire, it's that goblin fellow. Pee-wee! 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 Guard, take your horn back to his cell. Put him in chains and then find that Pee-wee goblin. Here we go again. I'll be back with your chains in a moment. <laughs> Pee-wee! How brave Pee-wee is. I just hope he doesn't get caught. If that goblin gets away, he can foil my plans. He must not escape! Uh, these chains will do nicely. Now all I need is my hammer. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> that should hold you for a while. <laughs> There's no way that giant is putting me in chains. This time I'm ready. <laughs> you look surprised. Well, I, I was expecting someone a little bigger. Come, we must free the princess. 
Do you think these will help? Quick! Check the dungeons! I can't find the right key. Hurry up! I hear them coming! Princess Sabina! Johan! If I'd known you were so pretty, I would have kidnapped you myself! No time for jokes, Pee-wee. Quick! Stop them before they escape! Keep going, you two! I'll take care of these lumps! Pee-wee! Pee-wee! We have them now! This passageway is a dead end! <laughs> That's what they think! Aha! They're escaping up the chimney! Pee-wee! It's only that fool, Pee-wee! You two catch him while I go after Johan and the princess. Sit yourself, my friend. <laughs> oh, no! How am I going to get down? Pee-wee's diversion must have worked. Out! Princess, stand back. On guard! My men have Johan cornered. Oh! Who goes there? You fool! Then let them get away! Huh? Well, I was outnumbered. We'll have to fight our way to the drawbridge. Johan and the princess. Will the guards stop them? No! But now, now there's a guard on the left. And another on the right. Oh, dear, Johan. Now it's two against one. But he's a big one. Oh, well, thanks for the help. Anytime, Johan. Yay! That's what I call teamwork. Uh-oh, more men. Johan's outnumbered. Johan, look! Look out! <laughs> Johan, Pee-wee, hurry! Faster! Get them! Close the trap door! Yeah! There, we are safe. My uncle, the king, is still in grave danger. Sir Piper is going to lead him into a trap. <laughs> I don't think so. Because I left Sir Piffy tied up like a Christmas goose back in the woods. Pee-wee, for a bad goblin, you do good work. But why did you come back at all? You owe us nothing. Don't be foolish, Johan. A goblin never deserts his friends. I see. Well, in that case, let's get on with our escape. And I think these old clothes may just do the trick. <laughs> We've got them trapped like rats up there. And tomorrow, the king will be my prisoner as well. I hope it's strong enough. Talk about hanging by a thread. Pee-wee, you go first, then help the princess. I'll distract the guards. Oh, simple. I just jump out the window 500 feet above sharp, pointed rocks and... All right, Pee-wee, go! <coughs> Who's sounding the horn? It's Johan. You can see him from here. Look! Someday, I'll have to give Johan some music lessons. Sire, it's a ruse. One of them is trying to escape. Fools, cut down his rope. Oh, no, they spotted Pee-wee. Pee-wee, jump. Jump? That could be dangerous. Never. That's one less goblin we have to worry about. <laughs> Poor Pee-wee. I didn't know him long, but he was a brave and good friend. It's too bad that... Yoong, look! There! He, he did, did it. it! He did, he did it! it. Yeah. Being a hero is difficult work. Now to warn the king. But first, I better check on that traitor, Pythroy. Oh, no! He's escaped, but that means he's at the king's castle. And if the king believes Pythroy's story, then the king will leave the castle, and then... Oh, dear! All is lost! And without Paquette, I'll never get there in time! <laughs> Faster! Your Highness! No! Don't go! It's a trap! Sire, do not listen to this rogue! This is the Goblin Pee-wee! I'm warning you, Sire! This Goblin is not to be believed! You're the goblin? Sir Pythroy told me you want a ransom for the princess. Your Majesty, I'm no goblin. I want no ransom, and Sir Pythroy is a traitor. But couldn't we discuss this better over uh, breakfast? <coughs> Where is Pythroy? He should have returned long ago. Well, but, but, but my lord, the king is here. Ah, finally. Victory is ours! Bring the king to me! But, but he brought his entire army as well! What? 
Look, Princess, the King and Pee Wee, we're saved! Uncle! Uncle! Hello, Sabina! Sire, shall I order the attack? Hmm, yes, an excellent idea. But how will we get across that moat? Leave it to me, Sire. Johan, the drawbridge! The drawbridge, of course! Up there, stop him! Oh! Now, where was I? Oh, the drawbridge, of course! Stop him! Don't let him get away! Oh! <laughs> oh! Johan, you've gone too far! Not far enough! I have you surrounded! No, Waltricket. It is I who have you surrounded. Charge! Oh, no! After him, Biquette! Help! Help! Save me! That's it, Biquette. Once more for good luck. Now one for kidnapping the princess. We'd better save that villain while there's still something to save. I surrender! I surrender! Just get that goblin and his devil goat out of here! Pee-wee! Pee-wee! Oh, defeat hurts. Oh, Uncle, I'm so happy. Pee-wee wasn't much of a goblin, but I think he'll make a great court jester. I won't come out! No, absolutely not! I refuse! Whatever's going on? I had a proper jester's outfit made for this little ingrate, and now he dares tell me! I hate it! I hate it! I hate it! Your Majesty, just because I'm supposed to act like a fool doesn't mean I have to look like one, too. <laughs> but he's so cute. <laughs> You'll pay for this, Dame Barbara. You poop. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> that's funny. What did I tell you, Johan? Pee-wee's a success. And that is how Pee-wee and I first met. It was the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Oh, how smurfy. Smurfy? That means nice. I think it means brave. Friendly. Dependable. Right. Now you're smurfing it. We, we are. are. Here, Pee-wee, let's be friends. I have a surprise. Gee, thanks, Jokey. I think our friendship just went up in smoke. Unless you wouldn't happen to have another surprise, would you? Wait till I give this to Dame Barbara. <laughs> Are you sure you know how it works? Of course! Oh, I can't wait to see her face when she opens the lid like this. <laughs> oh, the cat! I think Pee-wee's got a little head start on me. So long, my friends, until we meet again. Yeah! So long, Johan. See you soon.